there is it is called it is called first law of thermodynamics and it is important because it states it states that the increase in internal energy of a system equals the sum of heat supplied to the system and the work done on the system all right my bachu now there are certain keywords in this that you guys need to remember the first keyword is the first keyword is the increase in internal energy equals the sum of heat supplied to the system and the work done on the system see so you think keyword that when right then i'm going to explain what it means अच्छा अब क्या होना है रिमेंबर दिस द इंटरनल एनर्जी और वट एवर चेंज इन इंटरनल एनर्जी इज रिटर्न बाय दिस ठीक है सो पॉजिटिव साइन मींस इंक्रीज इफ इंटरनल एनर्जी इंक्रीजेस दैट इज बिकॉज ऑफ द हीट सप्लाइड दैट इज क्यू पॉजिटिव साइन मींस दैट इट्स बीइंग सप्लाइड एंड plus w which is work done which means the work is done on the system okay so yeah i'm going to write it this is increase in internal energy and internal energy basically depends on two things heat supplied to the system and this is work done on the system sir aapne energy ka symbol kya likha delta u acha theek ho gaya ye baat samajh aa gayi now when is something positive or negative the primary equation is this ये थोड़ा सा तुम लोग ना फिजिक्स का नहीं होगा इसमें इंग्लिश का टेस्ट होगा बिकॉज द प्रेपोजिशन आर गोइंग टू बी दंस डिसाइडिंग के कौन सा साइन लगेगा सो लेट मी जस्ट मेक अ टेबल टू एक्सप्लेन चलो 
सो यहाँ पे वी आर गोइंग टू राइट वेन समथिंग इज पॉजिटिव एंड वेन समथिंग इज नेगेटिव the first value is we need to know what happens to q what happens to change in internal energy and what happens to w theek hai q is heat hamesha you will add a positive sign to q if you see ke likha ho heat is supplied to the system and you will add negative sign when you say heat is lost by the system is it clear mere bachcha yes sir internal energy positive sign lagega when it, there is going to be increase in internal energy whatever it was before if it increases you say positive and negative when there is a decrease in internal energy agar work mein positive sign kab lagayenge hum log when it is going to be written work done on the system इंपॉर्टेंट बच्चा ओके एंड वर्क डन अगर होगा बाय द सिस्टम then you have to put a negative sign is it clear with you yes sir okay ab ek chote question karte hain so the example says a motor does 2000 hi sir sorry i'm late of work okay on its surroundings while releasing 3000 joules of heat determine the change in internal energy chalo jaldi se
माइनस फाइव थाउजेंड है लेट्स गेट माइनस फाइव थाउजेंड बाय बिकॉज़ द फर्स्ट लॉ ऑफ थर्मोडायनामिक्स स्टेट्स दैट द इंटरनल एनर्जी इंक्रीज इन इंटरनल एनर्जी इज इक्वल टू दिस ठीक है नाउ इन दिस पार्ट वी नीड टू फाइंड द इंटरनल एनर्जी राइट हियर सर सर अस्सलाम वालेकुम Wa-alaikum. So, can yes. you? I joined like five ten minutes late. Can you scroll up so I can take a screenshot of what I missed? You just missed. So, is this it? Yep. We haven't done anything else in today's class. What did I do? Sorry. Hey. So what we are going to do is, you see, this is the internal equation. So up here, the work is done on the surroundings. Yani, the system, the motor is the system which is doing. work on the surrounding which means the work is done by the system so it means you have to add mind 2000 here while releasing 3000 of heat which means heat is going out of the system so you have to add minus 3000 here so when you add it the total change in internal energy is going to be minus 5000 joules which means internal energy will decrease by 5000 is it clear मोटर बाय द सराउंडिंग Okay. Oh, right. So it it is more of a test of physics, no, test of prepositions, rather than physics. Now this is important because it can tell you a lot about gas laws, and gas laws is a particular topic that we need to be very very careful about because the first thing we have we have done it in all levels as well. The first law. boy the chef definition states that pressure is inversely proportional to volume provided that temperature is kept constant is it clear you already know this by the way pressure is inversely proportional to volume provided that temperature is constant now if i draw the graph of it i would just want to tell you black circle lines suppose this is the graph so this will be pressure in pascals this is going to be volume in meter cube so inverse ka hamesha jo curve hota hai yaad rakhna it is going to be like this okay mere bachcho now i am going to put certain points on it chalo points like a b c and d as you go from the volume increases the pressure decreases everybody can see that 
this curve this type of curve is called an isothermic curve isothermic means that temperatures on the light got it um sir could you repeat that please sir it means that is line pe jitne bhi points hain they are at the same temperature because according to boys Law when pressure and volume are changing, temperature is constant. Understood? Yes, sir. Now my question is that how it would affect the this change? How would it affect the law of thermodynamics? Okay, so let's write here. How does isothermic change affect the first law of thermodynamics aur ye cheez jo hai ye tum logo ko aani chahiye khud karna hai theek hai ab yaad rakhna bahut important the change in internal energy is given by q plus w plus q plus w we already know this right pehli cheez we also know that if the temperature change in temperature is zero then the internal energy which is given by the equation 3 by 2 nk delta t ye humne kiya hua hai pehle bhi in ideal gases if the temperature is zero then the change in internal energy will be zero am i right yes sir if that is the case then you must understand according to that equation change in internal energy is zero so it is going to be plus q plus w then what is the relationship whatever heat will be supplied will be equal to the work done on the surroundings understood heat does work on surroundings isiliye negative sign laga hua hai is it clear ye thoda sa technical cheez hai but yaad karna padega So can you repeat it again, like one more time? Yeah. Well, it's done. Okay. So what I'm saying is, yeah, the term. As gas is heated, molecules gain kinetic energy. You guys agree? Yes. Yeah, sure. so temperature increases you already know this yes ab humne ye ideal gases mein we have learned it that the internal energy which is basically dependent on the kinetic energy is equal to 3 by 2 nk and internal energy is also equal to half m c square you guys remember this equation yes no so in order to keep temperature constant yani there is no increase in temperature what do we need to do we allow the gas to expand 
ठीक है अब होगा क्या एक्सपेंशन से याद रखना सपोज यू हैव अ बलून ऑफ दिस साइज राइट नाउ अराउंड द बलून यू हैव ऑन इट देर इज एटमोस्फेरिक प्रेशर एक्ट and within the balloon itself the gas pressure is acting understood so they are in equilibrium right now okay if i supply heat to the gas inside the balloon what will happen will the balloon expand or will the balloon stay the same if i supply heat na the balloon is going to get bigger Do you guys understand what I'm saying? Yes. If it is getting bigger, so the forces inside are also larger, which means they're doing work against what? Against the surrounding air or atmosphere, right? Yes. Although the temperature doesn't change, but this negative sign right here shows that the heat that we supplied does work on the surrounding that is why there is a negative sign and temperature is the same that's why no it is change in internal energy samajh aa gayi mere bachcho yes sir koi question any question in this please let me know ye bada important hai nayi cheez hai to log bhi pehli baar padh rahe hain Up on Mazid. So, can I screenshot the question we did before this? Yes. Why not? Thank you, sir. Now, up the question is that what the hell is this happening? Okay, let me tell you what is happening. जब आपके पास कोई भी चीज दो गैसेस कंपेयर हम कर सकते हैं ठीक है एंड वी कैन सी के टेम्परेचर से क्या फर्क पड़ता है इन एन आइजोथर्मिक चेंज ठीक है सो सपोज वी हैव प्रेशर पास्कल्स हेयर एंड वी हैव वॉल्यूम इन मीटर क्यूब सो वन गैस और इवन द सिमिलर गैस वाज एट अ सर्टेन Temperature. Suppose the temperature was three uh, hundred Kelvin. So gas was behaving like this. Okay. Iski kuch points bana lete hain. A, B, C, D. Now what happens is that we increase the temperature. So the gas. Now we'll show you the same trend because it's. it's the same gas but the temperature now suppose it is 600 kelvin samajh aa gayi tum logo so let's say this is point p this is point q this is r this is s theek hai mere bachcho any questions right here yes. iska ye matlab hai that points A, B, C, and D are at same temperature, and points P, Q, R, and S are at same temperature. ये three hundred kelvins के ऊपर हैं सारे और ये six hundred kelvins पे हैं. The gas may be expanding, but the trend doesn't change. The graph just shifts. upwards if the there is a increase in temperature understood yes now look at another graph from the perspective itself so we are saying that actually suppose we have two stages of a particular gas so we got a stage like this and we got 
days like this. And of course, they're at different temperatures because the purple line will has to be a greater temperature. So, again, for example, the gas was point A, say, you see a particular pressure or volume pair. It goes from A to this point. Let's call this M, right? How is it possible that it goes from a lower temperature to higher temperature? Agar temperature change positive ho to. Is it clear? Do you guys understand what I'm saying? Yes. Sir. And if it comes to the same line again at point D, can I say that now it has lost the same change in temperature? So it comes to the same point on the graph, right? So, if I overall terms in the so A to M, the temperature change was positive T, whatever that was. And from M to D, it was minus delta T. And if I ask you directly, K A to M to D, kya hoga, you will say the change in temperature was zero. Because actually no change occurred. Really, you came to the same point. Understood? Overall, yes. it's the same. And if the temperature change is the same, then the change in internal energy will also be zero because it doesn't really, it's the same before and after the whole cycle. Samajagi, my bacho. Yes. So within a line, internal energy will always be a zero in Boyle's law. And if it comes back to the same point, it will be zero. Sakina, you understand what you're saying? You didn't say anything today. Yes, sir, I understand. Good, good. Now, let's go. The next law is basically called Charles law. Now, Charles law ki definition likh lo. Charles law states that volume of an ideal gas is directly proportional to the temperature or is condition ke provided pressure is kept constant. So volume and temperature directly proportional or provided pressure is constant. Up directly proportional ka jahan graph banate na mere bachcho. The graph is going to be like uh, volume on this temperature here. So graph is going to be just like this. P1 pressure, so we P2. So two different pressures for gas. So two lines. A, B, C, D. P, Q, R, S. Okay, so one gas for two pressures. Okay. Now, because this type 
ऑफ ग्राफ ये एक लाइन भी हो सकती है दो लाइन इसलिए बनाई है कि दे आर एट डिफरेंट प्रेशर्स अगर हो तो वॉट आई एम सेंग इज दिस सॉर्ट ऑफ चेंज इज कॉल्ड आइजो बैरिक चेंज आइजो बैरिक चेंज क्या होता है आइजो बैरिक चेंज मीन्स दैट प्रेशर एट ऑल पॉइंट ऑन अ लाइन इज कॉन्स्टेंट आइजो मीन्स सेम ठीक है इज इट क्लियर मे बच्चो बैरिक मीन्स प्रेशर अब कौन सा बच्चा मुझे बताएगा कि इन दोनों स्टेट्स में से P1 और P2 में से गैस जो भी ये गैस है वो P2 ज्यादा बड़ा प्रेशर है या P1 वन इन टर्म्स ऑफ वैल्यू मैग्नीट्यूड बताओ भाई सर सेम ही सॉरी सेम ही होंगे सर लाइन में सेम नजर आ रही सेम होंगे सर पी पी टू में प्रेशर ज्यादा है क्यों क्योंकि इसका वॉल्यूम कम है अभी कैसे पता चलेगा जो बोल रहा है ना ये सही बोल रहा है क्यों Because I can claim that P2 is greater than P1, not because उसका volume ज़्यादा है, because if you look at the equation which is P V over T equals to K, then we could simply say that volume is basically K T over P, right? Can I say that, please? Yes. So if I'm comparing the line with M X, then I saw Y axis पे V है, X axis पे T है. so the gradient is basically k upon p right so p is the inversely p is inverse of the gradient which means jisme volume ka change sabse kam hoga usme pressure zyada hoga because the change in volume with respect to temperature is less in p2 the gradient is less so we can write because the gradient is less of p2 so pressure will be more understood yes isko ye baat nahi samajh aayi kaun theek hai ab hum chalte hain aage the main question is How does isobaric change affect the first law dynamics for, for the first law of thermodynamics? Okay, my dear children. The first law is. change in internal energy is given by q plus the work done theek hai mere bachcho ab yaad rakhna the temperature is changing the heat may be supplied or not supplied doesn't matter the point is that it has constant pressure or i will take you back to one of the important things तो जब हमने ये थर्मल फिजिक्स स्टार्ट की थी ना सो आइडियल गैसेस में नहीं आइडियल गैसेस में कहा पे मैंने तुम लोग कराया था ऐसे कैसे हो सकता है कि मैंने कभी कराया नहीं तुम लोग नो वे इसी में तो नहीं कराया हुआ किसी में मैंने कराया था इसी चैप्टर में कराया हुआ हाँ जब हमने चैप्टर स्टार्ट किया था थर्मोडाइनमिक्स तो हमने एक इक्वेजन वेरी फर्स्ट डे आई रोट The equation was that work done is pressure times change in volume. It only works when pressure is constant. लिखा है था ना ये? Yes. Which means that अगर isobaric change तुम लोगों को नजर आ रहा हो, then 
you are going to write it as change in internal energy plus q will be dependent on pressure times change in volume and this is only for constant pressure on the other is it clear anybody who could not understand this now the last law that we are going to study is the pressure law and according to pressure law it states that the pressure is directly proportional to temperature provided that the volume is kept constant ye baat samajh aayi tum log so pressure yes. is directly proportional to temperature provided volume is constant now if i make the drawing itself <clears throat> so same goes you know it will be like pressure is in pascals temperature is in kelvins and the lines are going to be something like this start from the origin and like that so agar do different volumes pe gas hum maintain kar rahe so let's write v1 and v2 so yani all these points a b c d they're at the same volume and so is p q r and they are also at the same volume theek okay? hai because volume and pressure has inverse relationship which means that volume 2 will be greater than volume 1 ye main tum logo ko samjhati why because tum logo ko pata hai that the gradient if it's less then the volume is going to be more inverse relationship and that's why understood yes is change ko इस वाले चेंज को हम कहते हैं आइजोमेट्रिक चेंज आइजोमेट्रिक चेंज क्या होते हैं आइजोमेट्रिक चेंज वेयर वॉल्यूम इज कांस्टेंट आइजो मींस सेम मेट्रिक मींस रिलेटेड टू लेंथ वॉल्यूम अंडरस्टूड अब यहां और से देखना how does isometric change affect the first law of thermodynamics a pehli cheez ye hai that we know that work done is given by pressure times change in volume is there a change in volume happening here can somebody tell me yes eh kaise where sir constant hai constant ka matlab there is no change in volume right yes sir no so if change in volume is zero then can we conclude that work done will be zero yes sir and okay. if work is zero our main equation is that increase in uh, internal energy is given by the energy is applied to the system and work done which means 
that if work is zero in isometric chains, then it will be equal to just this. So whatever heat you supply, it is going to increase. If you remove heat, it is going to decrease internal energy. Yes. 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 Okay, we'll stop here. Okay. In the next class, we are going to do uh, certain questions. This chapter next class. Okay. And then we'll know that we apply questions. Chalo. Um, can, See ya. can I ask you a question? Yes. Sir, yes, please, yes. Uh, um, yeah, second session. Yes, the session, second session has started. Okay. okay. It is right now, just now. You want to join AS? Why? Haven't you given AS yet? No, sir. So you are going to give AS with Basam and Manur as a combined? Yeah. Okay. Okay. So, aap, uh, same days, it starts at 7. Okay. 7, 10. Okay. Okay, bachu. So, I'm going to see you in the next class. Then. Bye. Love this.